<clears throat> Hi guys, so I'm gonna go this way first because it's quite bright in the kitchen for some reason. Right, so I'm gonna tell you this first bit over here in the bedroom. I don't get why it's so bright um, when I do it this way. We'll go for this way, shall we? Anyway guys, so I'm gonna be truthful, I'm not gonna lie to people. Anything like that, I went off round. So I got down on the fact I weren't losing weight and all this lot. But now I've got an incentive. So from Saturday, I think it was, when the 1st of April started. Let's not do that. Um, so when the 1st of April started, guys, we started this cancer um, fundraiser up. So this will be going all through the year. So if you can't donate it one month, you can donate the next all the way till December. So, halfway through December, by the end of this year, I must have got down to 17 stone. My reward for myself of getting down to 17 stone is I get to go on them trampolines. So, that's an incentive for me, but it's also an incentive because I'm raising money for a charity. So, I'm actually raising money for cancer research, well, me and ABR. But we do where we run one page because we don't see why we should have multiple pages. I mean, sharing to two different pages and things like that. So we, I was updating it through the first day, through um, the actual just given page. But then I set up a Facebook page. So I have a Facebook page that every day there'll be activities on. Well, it won't be activities every day, but there will be updated every day on there everything so that's on facebook i will add the link at some point um for you guys but every day um there's going to be something different so this actual month though we are doing 60 miles with a dog now let me specify that we must walk the miles with the dog so me going out by myself without the dog not that i would ever would um doesn't class me walking around this house doesn't class so what does class is me actually getting off my bum home and putting my dog on a lead and taking her out the front door she's not allowed to be in her trolley which is the difficult thing um she actually has to walk so what we do is if he just lets his watch run 24 7 so i got this samsung watch back out but i am looking at getting the se apple watch one um at some point um so we count the steps on here so far we've done like two miles but it'd be easier on days out it's harder to do it here so basically now it is at his nan's so um we won't like heal class it when he's with Zeus, so when Zeus is actually walking around with him out on the farm, that's different. That's him counting it. He could count that. Um, but instead, we've decided it to count it when we've got both, like, for example, we're both together. So every day at some point, even if it's not staying over, we will meet up and we will get them steps in. So, for example, on a Tuesday, when we go out to Barnstable, um, and that we won't count our steps, obviously, on the bus. The steps will then count the moment we get off the bus and Rosebud's walking. So that's how the 60 miles works through the whole of, obviously, April. Um, at some point, they will be bingos going on and things like that. But obviously, you can't do that over my TikTok. I will be running raffles and things like that. I'm going to ask people to donate prizes. So I'm going to go and ask, like, um, Tesco's and things like that or like places where they can donate um vouchers um and prizes and things like that i'm gonna be asking businesses um obviously i will be donating a voucher of my own business well it's not a business it's more um a hobby like i said before like it's more i don't make any money and even then that would be coming out of my own pocket because it would cost me rather than anything else to make whatever they wanted so um there's that um we're gonna be i'm gonna look at doing coffee mornings and things like that but obviously there's gonna buy the oh and to finish the end of the year 
I also must walk so many miles. We haven't decided how many miles that's going to be. But we will let you know. And I mean, that's literally in one day. So where we're doing 60 miles through the whole month, it, I don't know, say 10 miles, we'd have to walk from one end of Cornwall to the next in one day. Or we'd do a two-day thing or something like that. That it's basically a non-stop thing. So we're going to be doing something like that. So I just wanted to introduce you guys back that we're going to be starting Hula Hoop from today. We're going to have a refresh. We've got to get back on it. I won't be going on holidays. We've decided to stay here for my 30th now um, and things like that. And I might be getting a, another puppy that's smaller than Rosebud at the end of April. So hopefully that will go well. If I end up with two more, they're not for me to keep. I am literally fostering them and finding them new homes. Um... They are the siblings of the female I'm looking at keeping. Um, but it's in the situation of I'm going to be having that dog. I'm not going to be all excited about keeping the puppy. Um, because I see it as I'm helping two of the puppies if I end up with the other two. But the reason I don't get excited is for my Minnie. When I had Minnie, she was too much. She was too a uh, reactive dog. So Minnie couldn't be an assistant dog. I, and for loads of other reasons this dog's going to be smaller than rosebud which is she's currently over there um so smaller than rosebud like is literally can sit in your hand obviously it might be as big as rosebud the time it grows but um it's currently two months old you have a passport everything for it like that so um because it's coming from romania um and they were my specific things that it must stay really small and everything so but yeah, so that will happen at the end of April. The whole through the year, we are going to be doing our cancer research, raising money. So like I said, we can't do this month. Donate the next month, whatever. Um, Keep an eye on, obviously, day-to-day -day activities that are going on. I will add, obviously, get the link for the page. I'll also add it onto my main TikTok at any point um, for people as well. But yeah, guys, I am just about to go and weigh myself because... Obviously, we're starting from Fresh Bang 1. And I can't believe I just found out that you can now do 10-minute clips after I've been mean, cutting my clips down yesterday to make them shorter. <sighs> really? Right, so I'm going to weigh myself. So my current weight is 21 stone, 6 pound. Let me see if I can show you guys. Right, now I'm 21 stone, 5 pound. There you go. So that is my current weight. Obviously, I knew that I would put weight on and things like that because I've been away, but I've also been doing a lot of walking while I was away because that's what I always do. So, the next thing we're going to try on, because obviously we're going to start this hula hoop situation again, is a hula hoop. I'm going to see if I need to add any. So, here's my hula hoop. I think I might just add one on there. So it's a bit tight, I don't know, but I'm deciding a bit. But yeah, guys, this is day one. Wish me luck. 